So look where I'm at now. Look where I'm at. I put my hood on the map. These niggas be shitty. At What's up, you guys? It's your girl Caitlyn, and I'm back with another video. But I'm back with another video. What? What? I'm back with another video. What's up? What's up? I'm back with another video. What's up? We popping. We lit. This is Caitlyn Osho. Make sure you guys follow me on social media. <laughs> I'm mad weird. But what's up, you guys? This is your girl Caitlyn. I'm back with another video. If you're new to my channel, hi. How are you? <laughs> How are you? It's Caitlyn. Be a part of the K-Y family. Um, okay. <laughs> so make sure you like, comment down below what I should do, who I should act to. You feel me? Follow my social media. You feel me? Let's get it. I should get popping. Um, let's do the intro. It's Kevin Ryan family. Family, 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 family. <laughs> Let's get it. Let's go, you guys. Okay, I'm so excited about this topic, y'all. Y'all already know what the topic. A bitch a graduate. <laughs> she graduated. Okay, listen, listen, baby. Oh, baby girl. If you haven't watched my other videos, like the reaction videos, reaction to the TikTok, only black people will find funny number three. On top of that, watch my other videos about me explaining about what school that, what school did I choose to go in the fall? Because I will be going to college. So, yeah. So, let's talk about this graduation. First, that's Okay, so. <laughs> yes, I graduate last Friday. And it was amazing. Like, literally amazing. It was just so, like. Like, I almost cry. Like, we had to do a virtual, you know. I'm still waiting on my diploma, though. So, I had to make sure I had to email my, you know, goddess counselor. Because I thought, like, when we got our cap and gowns, we're supposed to get our diplomas. I'd be like, okay, I'm good. I'm set. <laughs> Here you go. But, no, it doesn't turn out that way. So, <laughs> I'm about to wait this week. So, hopefully this week I get it. On top of that. Y'all, I was really upset because I really wanted to wear this red wig on my graduation day. But, <laughs> since COVID-19 tried to play me, I didn't get my wig yesterday, you know? I mean, not yesterday, Monday. And I don't know, it depends on whether or not I will post. I don't know when I will post the, these videos, okay? Because sometimes I be like, I want to edit. You feel me? When you want to do the most, like like me, or like I'll do the most when I be edit videos. Videos, so it's like yeah. But like, it's just really crazy because me coming from the coming from Horace Middle School. Y'all don't know what Horace Middle School. Y'all didn't watch my old, old old videos. But I don't know. It depends on my put a clip in there or I might just tell y'all well anyways I used to go to a harder hearing slash staff school so all we really got to do is like we, every day every single day when you're hearing this every single day sign you know that's how we do it but like as educational wise I was gonna say educational this is what happened when you mad got old Especially my, especially my mom. She be saying, oh, you better get your education. Like, girl, can you speak proper? Because I'm trying to be proper. You feel me? Like, we can't be doing that around here. So, yeah. Um, yeah. I think, yeah, I lost what I was going to say. But, it's like me, because I basically grew up 
in horseman school, like I was three or four, no, three years old when I arrived to horseman school. And like, you know, I meet a lot of people, you know, when I was little, people, some of the kids left. I forgot the name. Some of the kids that like, all right, P, you know, I don't have to say names, but like, yeah. I'm like Loki. I miss horseman school, but I, I'm sorry. I would say I miss half of the teachers, but not all the teachers, cause like y'all was giving me hell. Like it's gonna be another story. Should I say it? You know what? I will give you an. I will give you a story now. Okay, just comment down below if you want me to tell you the story about like how it is in horseman school. And I'm not gonna bash them or nothing like that, but yeah, about how I was when when I tell y'all when I listen when I I was I'm just gonna say I was a bad child. Okay, let's just let's like, come on, come on. I was a bad. Literally, I was so bad child. Like, once middle school hit, I was bad. Like, I, I, listen, I'm gonna just be honest. Me and my old friends, we used to run. When I say run, we used to run horse me in school. So, for all y'all new, newbies, hi, Mr. OGs, hey, cause we used to run horse me in school. Like, Everybody know, don't be talking crap about my friends because I'm going to find out. And I'm going to go find you in front of every single body. I'm not afraid to say my opinion, to say what I have to say to your face. Or disrespect you in your face. Or I probably might talk crap about you behind your back. Either way, I'm still going to tell you. That's how I was, and it was just really, like, but, okay, but everybody was saying, like, I'm brutally honest, like, brutally honest, like, I would say, like, it would be, okay, in my opinion, I'd be thinking, like, I'm being honest and saying what I have to say, but other people, they go think, like, can you, like, you're so rude, like, why would you say that to somebody? So, listen, I am trying my best. This is my thing. That's why I say, if you're going to ask me, oh, can't be honest about something. I'm like, do you want me to be honest? Cause I go there. But I just don't want to apologize to nobody. If you feel like you feel offended, but you want my opinion. So like that doesn't make any type of sense. And it's just like, what? Then don't ask for my opinion. Because I will do what I want. <laughs> Okay, um, what else? Yeah, so, so I'm going to 8th grade, once it was probably close to where, I mean, I think probably during the, when I started 8th grade or whatever, I wanted to leave, okay? What I mean, I want to go, I want to go. It was so annoying. Like, I will tell you another time about that story, you know? Oh, yes. I will tell a whole story about why I left horse meat school and went to a, a, I wouldn't say normal school. I would say, like, a hearing school. You know? So, after that, it was hard to find schools. Listen, the first school that I chose was, what was it? Boston Arts, mm, yeah, Boston Arts Academy. Yeah. And, I mean, I, I tried out, not for freshman, for sophomore year, I did. Yeah. And I'll tell you, well, no, I shouldn't tell y'all because I told y'all about it in my old videos. Yeah, when I talk about, like, 
wants to Orange Academy, about like how it is, like how like when you want to audition stuff like that. So that's how it is. And um, what else? Yeah, and then I found Bert, and I was like. When I choose Burke, I wasn't really thinking as much. But people was like, my friends were like, you go to the Burke? Oh, no. They ratchet as hell. They bougie. No. They, no. Nah, it's a bad school. This and I'm like, how is it a bad school? You feel me? So, I go, you know, freshman year. Let's say. We had fights uh, freshman year, freshman, 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 oh my god, ninth grade year is when we had a lot of fights. I was like, fights to fight back to back, back to back, back to back. Ninth grade year, ninth grade year was the best year ever, in my opinion. Because it was like so entertaining. Y'all should know me. Y'all know I watch fight videos. And if you get, if I sent you a fight videos, not know me. I love fight videos. I share to anybody who cares. If you want me to send you a fight video, not from my school, but like any fight videos off of Instagram, let me know and I'll send y'all some. Just go down below, get Instagram, and I'll follow you. Yeah, just know like. I'm not no stranger. I'm not like one of those celebrities. Can't talk. I'm not one of those famous YouTubers that's like, oh, they, they mad with you. They don't want to follow you back. Or you got to do something to get followed back. No, I don't do that. Just follow me and I ask you back. Like, what's up? So, yeah. Sophomore year was kind of getting rough, especially English. I was like, oh my gosh. You know, I, I kind of feel English a little bit. I ain't gonna cap. I ain't gonna cap. I kind of feel. Low key, kind of feel. Um, my, not math, English a little bit. But then, you know, I got back up. You know, a lot of teachers, a lot of support. I, at that time, I was still shy and it was hard for me to talk to certain teachers and stuff like that. But once 11th grade came, I was more like, more active, more asking questions, or like, oh, miss or sir, can you help me this and that? Like, in the beginning of the birth year, it was kind of struggling, but then at the end, like, I made it. I did it on my own. Listen, well, Excuse me. Um, I did it on my own, but then I have mass support. Just mass support, you know? And it's just like, it's sad because I'm gonna really miss my friends. No friends. My high school best friends. Hi, Michaela. Hi, Eliza. I Listen, we're gonna be going on trips, okay? During the summer, during the next summer, we're going on mad trips. But I kind of was thinking about doing like a, a Airbnb only for seniors because everyone graduate. So yeah. So um, yeah. So like, and also the thing that I hate when I hear about people bashing my school is oh the Burke is ghetto. Well yeah the Burke is ghetto. I'm saying that the old oh, the is. Oh, um, what they be saying? They be saying all kinds of stuff. Talking about, oh, the break is bad. This is that. How is it bad if you haven't lived with it? You feel me? You haven't, you know, live with it. You haven't go to classes and that. I'm telling you, education wise is very good. It's very, very good. Honestly, if if I didn't come to the break, I'm sorry. I could honestly say that if I were to stay at Hornsby School, I wouldn't graduate. Because the way they work is just very... Mm, so, yeah. But I just hate when people say that, oh, there's a lot of fights. Yes, there's a lot of fights. But you haven't stepped in 
to a to a Burke community and be around us. We no matter how no matter how hard we argue and disagree and how we fight, we love each other. We will always support each other no matter what. Because guess what? We are a Burke community. We help one another. Okay, that's one thing about us that y'all can never say. Like, we help one another. Even though we might not say that you, you don't really talk to that person, this and that. They need help. We always, we always like, come on now. We're, like, we have so much support for one another. And it's really crazy. And I really like that. And I really appreciate it. Yes, it's ghetto. Yes, we have a lot of fights. But don't forget, as, education-wise... It's smart. You know, a lot of people had Val Victorian. Like that from a school that's my ghetto. That, oh, their education is whack. You're bugging. You're bugging. That's just, like, the Burke is really good. Yes, it might be fight. Yes, your parents might say no because, like, oh, it was a shootout over there. Or it was a lot of friends. You don't want to get involved with that. But y'all got to take. A uh, step back and think like education wise is very good. So if you are interested in going to Burke High School, ask me questions. If you live in Boston, if you are about to become a ninth grader and you are interested in going to the Burke, but you're afraid that your parents might not allow you. To go text me and I will tell you how it is at the school. It's very supportive. It literally is very supportive. And yeah, like come on now. Like it's very supportive. But if you would have asked me like skipping months, oh yeah, I used to skip classes. During my sophomore years, I used to skip class. But when was the 12th grade year? Yo, it's that time where we had this whole celebration, so it's like, I really wasn't concerned, you know. I had to get my hair done. I had braids, if y'all see me on Snapchat. Like, I had braids. Like, I was like, bye, y'all. I'm about to get my hair done. I come right back. And yes, the hell I did. I came right back. I had my, I had box braids in. I came back. They had food and everything. But I see there's, you know, more food that's left out. So, like, let me grab a some. Before I go home. So it's like. And then pictures. Picture day. At the end I will show you guys. Pictures of. My you know. Senior picture day. And all that shit stuff. So. I hope you guys like this video. This video is kind of long. I didn't expect. Well I kind of did. But like. But just know that, like, if you need support, I'm here. Like, if you live in Boston, if you're really thinking about going to the park, text me. I mean, not text me, but, like, DM me on Instagram. You can add me on Snapchat. But just let me know that's, like, oh, you came from my YouTube channel. Because sometimes I won't, I'll be like, who is this person? Why did I add me? Oh, why did I text me? Just say your I K Mariah's fan, not a fan, family, that you want to ask me questions. Feel free to ask me questions. And I want to do a Q&A video. So please, comment down, comment down below what kind of question y'all want to ask me. Because like, I haven't done a Q&A video in so long. So I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you like, comment down below what I should do, who I should react to. I'll see you guys next time. Okay, my family, 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 family. Also, follow my social media. See you guys next time. Bye bye. Love you. Ask me out. Ask me out. Ask me out.